Okay, in a very short, concise way, if you could tell me what is Amasari? Amasari is the camu berry in its purest form in a capsule. And that capsule is going to give you more vibrance, it's going to give you less pain, it's going to give you a lot of things because of the myriad of nutrients that are in there to optimize your health. I have prepared here, um, actually it's a list of the amino acids that can be found in the Kamu Kamu Berry and therefore in Amasari. So let's start with the first one here, it's threonine. Threonine, right. Intestinal malfunction, people that have intestinal problems, and liver support. People forget their livers. The liver is a filter and it's an extremely important organ. This helps support those two things, intestines and liver. Serine. 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 Okay. Serine is one of those amino acids that's, that's extremely important for mental clarity and brain function. I started taking Amasari and I felt like the fog had lifted. Would that be considered mental clarity? Yes, and the fog had lifted not only because of the amino acids, but because of the anti-inflammatory and the antioxidative properties that are happening also. Because in order for you to think properly, blood has to get to the brain. <laughs> if things are swollen up, the blood's not going to get there. And it's that simple. Blood takes nutrients in and blood takes the waste materials out. It comes down to blood flow. All right, so glutamic acid. Glutamic acid, again, one of those amino acids that, that works for cognitive function. Again, working close with the serine. It becomes really important, see, as an adult, you're, you know, you're dealing with emails and you're trying to do your taxes and your bills. All that seems to be where you need your brain to function at its highest. Not only that, but just to simply drive your car and to take care of your children and to go grocery shopping. How about proline? Proline. Okay. Proline is what is called a non-essential uh, amino acid, important for tendons, important for ligaments, important for muscles. Wow, okay, so I didn't even know that I needed that one, but I yes. do because of all the exercise. I deal with so many people who've got tennis elbow or wrist issues and carpal tunnel. All of those things could be possibly helped by that? Yes. Okay, glycine. Glycine is one of those things, that one of those amino acids that's very important to get rid of some of the effects of alcohol. Again, it helps with the liver and it works very closely with the, the threonine that we talked about first. Mm -hmm. So, and again, these don't work separately. All of these amino acids work together. Okay, our next one here, tell me the Alanine. Mm -hmm. Alanine for the immune system. Very important for the immune system. All of this is in here? Yes. Okay, and if yes. you're, let me ask you a question. If you're not taking this, and I'm not eating the best diet in the world, where am I getting this or am I just not getting it? You're not getting it. You're Got not it. getting some of these because some of these are essential, some of them are non-essential, and in, for the essentials, you need to make sure that you get them from a source. You're, they're essential to the body. Valine. Valine. Valine is very important for cell function, but also for nerve function. Now, every single nerve has a coating around it. It's called the myelin sheath. If you think of this as an electrical wire, if you touch that an electrical wire mm -hmm. that's not coated, you're gonna get a shock. Right. The valine, has is the protection that that is part of the development of that myelin sheet that keeps the nerves from short circuiting. I want all of these things in my body. You've so convinced me, and I'm sure so many people out there. I mean, the list goes on, by the way, of things that you need in your body that you are not getting enough of. So you wonder why you end up at the doctor sick because you're not getting enough of what you need. Tell me what that is. Isoleucine. Okay. It is important for building lean muscle mass. It is in a lot of the bodybuilder formulas, mm -hmm. and it's, a, it's a, again, a very important amino acid. You know, I've taken some of those formulas. I have a lot of those vitamins at home. Synthetic, mm -hmm. not from a berry, not real. Exactly, exactly. That is a great have point. Have I learned something here? That is a great okay. point. So you're getting a synthetic substance that the body doesn't recognize, and it's saying, whoa, what is this stuff? What am I going to do with this? Versus, oh, I know who you are and it uses it and utilizes it. Okay, so now this could be my favorite one. I actually know the answer to this one, leucine. Well, leucine is one of those very important amino acids that helps can save with, your marriage. That can save your marriage. Why? Fatigue yes. and irritability. <clears throat> Where has leucine been all my life? Where has leucine been all my life is for sure, and it's true. If I'm not getting it from here, where would I ever get this from? You could probably get it from some other foods, but it's not readily available in the concentrations that we have. I haven't been getting this, like, in, just in the so Amasari. you know. But see, that's interesting because, and as a woman who, and you, you know, we're kind of dismissed. Oh, you're irritable or, you know, you've got whatever going on. And you're like, no, there's something actually internal that I'm missing. I have noticed, and I know this is my kids will attest to this, I'm a little nicer. 
Like I just feel not as tense. I did not realize that that would be a benefit of taking Amasari, and I'm so glad that you pointed that out to me. And it's not always the hormones. But remember, yes. even for proper hormonal function, you need certain nutrients. If you don't have the right amino acids, your hormones are not going to function the way they're supposed to function. Well, because I think you need to look at your body. I, again, I go back, most people take better care of their car than their body. If you take one of the wheels off, the car doesn't go. So if you don't feed your body all the components that it needs to work, it doesn't go. And what are you? You're tired, you're irritable, your blood sugar's low, you've got all kinds of other issues, you start to get inflamed, and where do you end up? At the doctor's office. I'd much rather sit with you as a doctor right here mm -hmm. and help prevent anything that goes on. No and question. the other thing too is it's very important to mention here, what we're talking about is not side effects but side benefits of taking this product. Correct. Next one. Tyrosine is again another one of those amino acids that's important for the nervous system. Okay. And I don't want to get into mentioning all kinds of disease states but there are certain children that are very active mm -hmm. and a lot of these children may have tyrosine deficiencies. Next. Cysteine. Cysteine is very important for people that have blood sugar issues and blood sugar problems. It's also very important for people because it, it helps getting rid of the free radicals or the bad effects of oxidation. Okay, but when you go back to blood sugar issues, that is more and more people in this country I'm noticing. The numbers are staggering. You can't get in to see an endocrinologist today, which is a, a sugar specialist, because they're so backed up with all the diabetics. So would you recommend this to somebody who's dealing with a blood sugar issue? Yes, here's why. It isn't only the, the, the cysteine, right. it is also the ellagic acid. Because that The does... ellagic acid is another one of those substances that is in the amasari that helps balance and regulate blood sugar. It is extremely important. I tell you what, I wish that I had this through my 20s and 30s. I can always tell when it's four o'clock because I would want chocolate. Mm -hmm. I needed a sugar hit. To balance out your blood sugar, even at a non-diabetic level, is so vitally important. The reason people have the sugar crashes is because when you eat the wrong food, mm -hmm. let's say you have lunch and you have a sugar meal. What happens is your blood sugar goes up. Your body produces insulin to bring that blood sugar back down. The problem is every time your body produces insulin, insulin builds fat. So insulin is called a lipogenic substance. That's why people who inject insulin, they gain 10, 15, 20 pounds just like that as soon as they start. So what we want to do is we don't want the sugar to go up here and insulin to be produced. We want sugar to go up very gradually and kind of maintain throughout the day. That's the key and that's what the regulation and the vitamins and the nutrients and the supplements, the diet all does. I want everyone to try this product. I know that sounds like a very bold statement, but everything that you've mentioned is somebody in my life that's dealing with some issue. Don't you deserve, you, your family, your coworkers, people you're around, to try this and see what it does to your own body? And again, it's gonna be different in everybody. For some people, you'll feel an effect immediately. I did after two days, I noticed a huge difference. Some people after a week, but certainly no more than two or three weeks, almost everyone will feel something. They should feel something because again, everybody has inflammation. And I think the ability to harness that and to say, I don't want this to happen anymore, is, is the key. And it's internal. The internal regulation is going to show up on the outside, whether it be your mood, whether it be your skin, whether it be just the general feeling. It's going to show up if you take care of this on the inside, the outside's going to look better. I'm in my 50s, and I, you know, sometimes that's hard to admit on, on camera but I feel and I think I look better than I did in my 20s and 30s because not only do I supplement better, I eat better, I exercise regularly, but all of those things as a whole seem to really work. It's not yes. that big a mystery, but this, see this is a key that I never had. You never want to be without this. Let me just finish the last four here because okay. if you're paying, if you're sitting on the edge of your seat like I am, perhaps we haven't even gotten to something that's bothering you. Cysteine, yes? Cysteine, His cysteine again, uh, the benefit for, for diabetics, we talked about that, important for the colon. Important for the colon, don't dismiss that, because I have a whole group of friends now who are dealing with that issue. How does it help in that arena? You need certain amino acids in order to regulate the function of the bowels. Okay. As crazy as that may seem, you know, probiotics, one of my favorite things that I think everybody needs to be on. But not only that, it's giving the body the fuel to do what it's supposed to do. And this is just another part of the engine. It is, and it's one not to be ignored. As yes. you get very holistically, you realize what comes in must go out somewhere and it's all gotta work together. 
I tell people, I can look at your skin and I can tell you what your intestines look like. Because your skin is a direct mirror of what's going on inside your intestines. It's funny because last night I was watching a very A-list actress has a new book out. And she was talking about how at some point her face had broken out in like these cystic polyps. Mm -hmm. And she was thinking to herself, if my face looks like this, what does my inside look like? Why would it be any different? It looks a lot uglier. Okay, on that note, <laughs> <laughs> lysine. Lysine. We started talking about lysine, an amino acid that I use all the time in patients that have cold sores, fever blisters. So you would just prescribe that? L-lysine. Well, L-lysine, is it comes in a, in a supplement form, but mm. I don't do that anymore. I tell them to take the Amasari, and, I, and I'm even as bold as to tell them to open up the capsule, and put a little bit on the fever blister. Oh my gosh. Why not? You would help so many people. There's nothing synthetic, there's nothing dangerous, there's no chemicals, there's only side benefits. Right. Why not? What do you have to lose? You know what you've got to gain is your confidence back. I see so many people who suffer with cold sores and fever blisters that are very embarrassed. Don't go out while that's happening. Absolutely. Histidine. It's not histamine, by the way, it's histidine. Histidine. It's an, it, right, histidine. Histamine is what's released when you have some kind of an allergic phenomenon going on. I'm glad this you went is, to medical school. Right. <laughs> this is histidine. This is for, again, important for people with joint issues, important for people with stomach issues, and, and also a lot of these folks that are dialyzed, people that are on kidney, kid, renal dialysis, kidney dialysis, Histidine is one of the amino acids that's lost in huge amounts in those folks. And by the way, anybody that's being that's going through that process, this is absolutely safe. I have patients in my own practice that use this that are going through dialysis. What if you're suffering with rheumatoid arthritis, your hands hurt? I deal with a lot of people in that state. Helpful? Absolutely. Absolutely. That's all I'm going to say. Absolutely. I think that's all you need to say. Last one. Oh, well, this is one I use as a bodybuilder. L-arginine. L-arginine. Arginine is, again, one of those, it's, it's a vasodilator. It opens up the blood vessels, and if it opens up the blood vessels, it promotes better blood flow. And, and that's that is the key to life, about. isn't it? That's, that's your... the key to life. Okay, that's a really long list of active amino acids, and that's just part of what's in, I'm sorry. That's a fraction of what's in there. Okay, you know, this is one of those things that I think I've been looking for forever. How do you feel that you've found this? I feel great given the fact that I can now improve the quality of people's life because so many people are running on empty. They're running on fumes. But when you fill that tank back up with the right fuel, this allows the car, the engine to perform and function at the level that it was supposed to be at.